to me. I can just imagine. No, it's a perfect song you're playing. Okay, yeah. so uh, we know you know the studio. <laughs> Abe, <laughs> listen. Feel free to be jealous. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm, I'm telling you, Sunday is going to be a great event. It's going to be happening Sunday. Uh, that's August 20th at the AC Hotel Kingston. At 7 p.m. Yeah, there's also going to be a mini pre-show thing going on at about 5 p.m. So if you come out early, you know, yeah. so they're going to take care of you as well. If you don't get your ticketers yet, don't be late. Please, yeah, hurry up and get it, please. <laughs> All right. So on the left, I believe we have Leanne Fullwood. That's me. All right. And she's representing Miss, Az- well, she's Miss Azan Tisan. Absolutely. All right. See? Well, they might, they might, they might yeah, we're funny. <laughs> gross, and gross. also to the right, I have Tia Dryden. Hello. All right. And she's Miss Windsor Wellness. Miss Windsor Wellness, yes. See there. All right. So two lovely ladies. Once again, I'm just going to ask you to introduce yourself, you know, name, anything you want to add, and as well as, you know, why you decided to be a part of this competition. Yes. Okay, my name is Tia Dryden, yeah. and I am an architectural designer by profession. I really do enjoy anything having to do with female empowerment, mm. the environment, whether that be the built or the natural environment. I'm all about sustainability, mm. and I just want everybody to know that, you know, we should just go out and take care of our surroundings. Yeah. Nice. All right, and for you? I am Leanne Fullwood. I grew up in your town, St. Catherine. I consider myself someone that is a real lover of my island. Before I was one years old, I had been to every parish in Jamaica. Nice. My parents made it a norm for us. Every weekend or every other weekend in summer, mm-hmm. we'd travel around Jamaica, we'd stop somewhere for the night, and because of that, I joined this pageant not only because of the platform and being able to use my voice to advocate for the voiceless, Mm -hmm. but just to show my true and utter love for my island, for our food, for our culture. I will argue with anybody, Jamaica is the best (laughs) island in the Caribbean. (laughs) That is true. Listen Um, to me. Jamaica is the Caribbean. We we won't get there. We won't get there. Let's Fighting words. You know that one of the main things on the Jamaican list is that we are a set of humble, proud people. We are. So why are we being we're proud? A mixture. We're a mixture. We have a mix of little humility. Just, tonight, like, you know? we are just yeah. like how we're the kindest, yeah. tastiest people. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're the best oxymorons. Right? Oh, yeah. we, have, we have a balance of everything. <laughs> and while I want to talk to you guys about balance right now, I want to know, how do you balance this competition with your regular lifestyle? How are you doing it? How do you mm-hmm. ladies manage that? I have to say this competition is definitely teaching me time management. Yes. Oh, yeah. uh, because being a professional mm-hmm. and being in this pageant space, I have to say you also have to have a good support system. Absolutely. Yes. So my family and my friends, they are there for me every step of the way. No matter what I need, I, I can call on somebody Mm -hmm. to assist me with that task okay so yes having a good support system is it no i completely agree my support system my mom my cousin uh, my family friends who have just rallied behind me in the competition don't Mm -hmm. get me wrong it's hard Mm -hmm. yeah it is really some long hours and you're putting your all into it Mm -hmm. but what's important is that you always remember what's to gain Mm -hmm. you always remember the journey that you're on Mm -hmm. and thankfully my family is right behind me and they see my potential and they see where i'm going and they just make it easy nice okay well if so if there is someone who was a young lady who was interested in entering this competition what is let's just say one key piece of advice you would give her all right that's the idea is ready all right. yeah. <laughs> have a good support system yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yes yeah that is get it. your team together get a team because yes. you'll need it okay you'll definitely need it all right i'd say before you enter, make sure you know who you are mm-hmm. yes. and where you want to go in life. You don't necessarily have to have it all planned out mm-hmm. because a lot of life is figuring it out. Yes. But be sure in who you are and the message you want to leave behind because it's a platform. And you definitely want to be remembered for being kind or being you know, generous, wanting to give back. Yes. Just know that you go into it with a clear mind and a clear heart and you'll do great. All right. So, I mean, we're going to cool down for a second. So, I want to know, because you guys have been on several different activities, places here and there. What would you say is basically your most enjoyable moment? 
out of the competition so far. <laughs> There's so many. I know. That's why it's going to be a challenge. So you I just want to know one that comes to mind. One that I say is very special. Yeah. We have some amazing singers in uh-huh. our group. Yeah. And one morning, right before we did our sashing, mm-hmm. we had a little um, devotion. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And just the voices early morning the air is crisp and you're just hearing this beautiful harmony in mm-hmm. the room and it's uplifting it it made the day feel surreal mm-hmm. and any nerves of going on that stage and presenting in front of everyone mm-hmm. just that sense of sisterhood we have each other's back we're there to just have a good time yeah. it made going into the competition so just it made us look forward to it nice all right i like that <laughs> one even can do back that again for me we have to go back we have the video we have to get the video what about you tia i really do enjoy just always being around these ladies mm-hmm. the sisterhood that we have here and as leon said mm. the twins their voice yes, yes. <laughs> You should hear it. What? No, I can hear the speech business. <laughs> like every They're, time they do, they sing. Yeah, goosebumps. Yeah. Yeah. I, wow. I just zone out, mm-hmm. and uh, it just takes me somewhere very peaceful, peaceful and serene. Yeah. Okay. Well, I like that. So see, there you have it, you know, people. So I got some special guests coming up because we need to get them in <laughs> studio. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. So, I mean, we have the competition on Sunday. I mean, I'll, I'll be probably a bit of nerves, a bit of excitement. Um, but we always want to know, you know, what other projects are you looking forward to in the future? We know the competition is there, you know. But what other plans? What I'm sure we're going to see your name out there somewhere yes. for other things. So what other plans we can look forward for for you, um, Tia or Leah? I have so many. Yes. Firstly, I'll be working towards getting registered mm-hmm. as an architect, which is going to take a few years, yeah. mm-hmm. but that is an aim. And then just continuing all of my charitable efforts. Mm-hmm. Right now, I am the foundation chair for the Rotary Club of Kingston, mm-hmm. as well as the project lead for the What Women Want Foundation. Mm-hmm. I just want to continue those works because it brings me a lot of joy yeah. just giving back to the community. All right. What about you? Julian, what will you be up to? Well, I studied politics mm-hmm. and one thing that I recognize with this platform is how I can go off and channel my advocacy. Mm-hmm. So what I see myself doing in the future is doing just that, just being an advocate for mm-hmm. specifically young girls. My altruism project centers around Mary's Child Home, which is mm-hmm. a home for pregnant teenage girls. And the woman that runs the home, Nadia, she personally takes on these cases herself. Yeah. She wants to make sure the girls get justice and feel safe. Mm-hmm. I want to highlight her. With this crown, I want to represent all the struggles that Jamaican women face. Mm-hmm. I want to show them that through it we can survive, through it we can push through, and just spread that positivity. I want to be known for that. I want that to be my legacy. Why? Mm. I tell you, I see. I think oh, I see no, we have to. We have to. Yeah, yeah. I, no, I think I see. You know, poetic. For um, can we have how many? Twi- can we have twenty? <laughs> 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 oh, this not this point. Oh, need to duplicate that crown now because we have several uh, crowns to distribute. Yes. I think we need all of them out there doing their thing. I mean, no, but I think regardless, as you said earlier, yeah. at this point with the talent I have seen today, like. It's a tough competition, uh-huh. but at the same time, I'm already proud of whoever wins because yeah. you guys have all been like great representatives in your own way. So, I mean, I know it's going to be, I know everybody has a hope of, you know, first place, that's the aim. But mm-hmm. ladies, I hope you guys, if that's not the outcome, don't be disappointed because you guys have achieved so much because mm-hmm. I have not gotten to experience you guys before today and trust me the impact you all had listen honestly we're trying to spread a message that it's not just a beauty pageant yeah. exactly. that's the link of it mm-hmm. there's not just 29 beautiful women there's yeah. 29 intelligent yes. talented multi- multifaceted women mm-hmm. who will surprise and you then, yeah and then I mean beauty is subjective if we're looking about just the physical in us yeah. Yeah. Really, actually what I'm actually is like a package I'm getting here it's a I'm package voice, everybody has I'm their own the package act- the yeah. personality, the How they poise. speak and what inspires them. And then we're not going to figure out the Genesepa. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, right now, I just want to call in all the ladies from, you know, earlier. But while they are coming in, I want you two to, anybody you'd like to big up, any shout out, any, yes. you know, persons in your background that listen to me, I have to tell them, you know, every chance I get, thank you. Thank you to my parents, mommy, daddy. You know, biggest supporters, my niece, nephew, and my brother, sister, and my friends. Mm-hmm. Oh my, thank you guys. All right. 
Oh, I like to say thank you to my parents, my cousins, just my family in general. My family has always been ten toes behind me. Mm -hmm. My friends are my one of my biggest support systems. I have a big group of girls who are always having my back, and I want to send them all my love. I want to send love just to my country. I hope I can represent you as great as possible. Hello, Jamaica, and I hope. You know, everyone has a great week. I hope you have a great year. All right. So there you have it, people. We have right now sitting down, we have Leanne Fullwood on the left. We have Tia Dryden on the right. Coming in from the uh, background there, we would have, let's see if I still have this correctly. We have Shanique. Ro wait, Shanique, no, Shanique is over here. Right. Shanique Robinson on the right. Moving along, we're going to go to... Uh, Sasha Gay, yeah. right there next to her. Then we have Ayanna Powell. Uh -huh. And then we have Nikel Maria. There right? Nice. So, ladies, <laughs> thank you very much for joining us in studio. Um, this is Fantastic Fridays on New Start 93 FM. All the best on Sunday. Go ahead yes. and represent. Yes. All right. And you can just say hi to Jamaica. Hi, Jamaica. Hi, Jamaica. Hi, Jamaica. <laughs> hi, Jamaica. <laughs> and I mean, um, what, what 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 did it say now? Do you guys have a like a, a, a chair you girls do or anything a for them? Do we? No, no, no. no. Oh, so you know you guys need to create one before no, Sunday, no, right? I mean, you guys have been several places. Yeah. So, you know, when you leave, you just just a bye and gone. <laughs> well, one thing we do yes. is a vote of thanks. Okay. So, on behalf of the, <laughs> yes, this yes, universe yes. organization, on behalf of all the contestants, yes. thank you for giving us the opportunity yes. to show our personalities. Mm -hmm. yeah. Thank you for giving us the opportunity to spread the message that we are not just a pageant for beauty. We are smart, we're multifaceted, and just thank you for having us. All right, and I want you to give me a vote of thanks by saying the following line. <laughs> You're locked into Fantastic Fridays on Newstalk 93 FM. You're locked into Fantastic Fridays on Newstalk 93 FM. <laughs> I love it, I love it. Ladies, thank, thank you, you very ladies. much for coming out. Thank you. <laughs> See you guys on Sunday. See you on Sunday. I'm not vote for already now. Huh? Yeah. At this point, I'm going to take how much fake account I create. I'm going to take how much fake account I create. We're going to go to the 7 o'clock break. We're not getting in trouble right now. Thank you, ladies. <laughs> Have a wonderful weekend. Cool off, chill. Yes. Relax yourself. And okay. enjoy the process. Yeah. Enjoy. Yeah. Enjoy. 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 Yes. Yeah, but you know, try and keep it calm for a while. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and enjoy yourselves on Sunday, all right? Thank we will. you. All right. See you then. We're going to go to the break. When we return, oh, before you ladies go, do you guys know how important date night is to relationships? Yes. Yes. All right. Well, Kim, Kim is going to talk about that at 7 p.m. <laughs> so, thank ladies for joining us. We'll, we'll, we'll talk more. Don't go anywhere. Fantastic Friday continues. <laughs>